What this tells me is that I've always known that the music or the band seems to affect a lot of people. It touches them in different ways and all that. But in this kind of deepens the understanding of how much it means to a lot of people. It's not just music that you listen to. It seems to bring out playfulness, adventurous things like going to Wembley and all this kind of stuff. And I don't know. I'm moved. I think it's quite extraordinary. And and to me, the relationship with the band and fans, in certain way, is very clear. We give music, and these people actually seem to like what we do. And for that, I have to give them respect. It defines the fact that we've actually managed to do something right. They are the people that actually make us able to survive, to continue this thing, write the music, do the albums, do the tours, because these people, they like the band, they like us, they like the music, they buy the albums, come to the shows and everything. So, yeah, I'm both grateful and respectful for that. Thank you. Was there any surprises? Or? That was simply brilliant. It really, really was. Um, it was also surprisingly moving and in a way inspiring to see all this and uh, I think it was Jenna who said it at one point which was the highlight of the documentary for me it's all about sharing um, the fact that we're able to bring people together regardless of nationality age gender race and uh, give them the chance to live it all together. That's what it's all about. And that was by far the most moving aspect of the documentary for me. Uh, I knew I was going to have to say something, but I'm still in the, in the taking everything in because it was so much, it was so beautiful and so, um, so beautifully told the story because Indeed, we know, we, we, we read things, we hear, we meet a lot of people. But to, to see it in a documentary like this puts it in a whole new perspective again, a realization. Because um, I'm also just a person who sees the world in a certain way from my end of. And a lot of people see the same world from a completely different angle. A lot of different angles, but we share one big passion and that's the music. Uh, of Nightwish, and that is, like Duoma said, it's, um, it goes beyond boundaries, it goes beyond gender, it goes beyond anything else. And in a time where the world is divided, as it always seems to be, and sometimes a little bit more than normal than maybe now, this is what makes everybody the same. We love this, this one big family, and the, what Jenna said was beautiful. And there were a lot of beautiful quotes. I was really touched by the little animations of the story with the books, with the music. I. Uh, Ah, uh, yeah, I'm probably going to think like, I know fans think, oh, there was a hundred million things I wanted to say and I didn't know what to say really. But um, yeah, I'm truly touched. Thank you. How about? Uh, yeah, <laughs> I'm quite speechless as well. Uh, I think it would have been better with more car chases and more dinosaurs maybe <laughs> chasing people around. But, but, uh, but apart, apart from that, uh, I thought the, the, uh, the sincerity uh, was hitting me in buckets. It was so lovely to see um, such honest, um, I think devotion isn't so much the word, I think just honest love of, of what's going on here. Uh, what we actually stand for as well uh, as a band um, yeah more car chases next time I think um, and I only caught the end because I felt asleep at the beginning I was asleep for most of it but it looked really good at the end what I saw <laughs> yeah but um, yeah wonderful stuff wonderful yeah what else to say than the rest of the bandmates just have to say that maybe two words came to my mind like beautiful and really powerful so thank you people thank you I think they they said everything already but, <laughs> <laughs> but we have very nice big family thank you <laughs>